of you, and we think that you're on your way, and we are trying to tell you you can do it. Sadly, in our culture today, not enough dads are doing what we're doing tonight. Now, even if your blood father isn't here, a collection of all of us here tonight still represents the community of men that is supporting you. Okay? So this is something that fathers and sons have done for years and years and years and years and years and years. Okay? Because wrestling is a tough sport. And not everybody can do it. So we're proud of you. For how much we scream and yell at you, we're proud of you. And so tonight is an opportunity for us to publicly say you're doing an awesome job. We expect bigger and better things and kind of welcome to the club, even though it's an ongoing series. So it's kind of solemn, it's kind of ceremonial, it's kind of special. So you need to treat it that way, okay? Because we're not kids anymore. And if you want to be treated like young men and given those rights and responsibilities, you got to accept and how to act, right? In the Bible it says, when I was a boy, a child, I acted like a child. But when I became a man, I gave up my childish ways. So this is an opportunity for us to say, congratulations, we believe in you, and let's, let's keep on working. Okay? Does that make sense? All right, we're going to start with the junior high first. This is the first year we've had so many junior high do 3,000. And so we want to celebrate those guys for doing 3,000 and for having a great season. It's not tough being, a, it's not easy being a junior high wrestler here in the district. And you guys are part of the group. Tyler Nelson's group, I think, was really the first group as eighth graders that kind of set the mark. And last year's group was Mike Jones and the other freshmen. You guys. Right, so we want to celebrate. 